Mayor of Moscow incumbent Sergei Semenovich Sobyanin is a Russian politician, serving as the third mayor of Moscow since 21 October 2010. Sobyanin previously served as the governor of Tiumen Oblast. Sobyanin is a member of the ruling United Russia Political Party and is elected to its higher governing bodies. Current member of President of Regional Council of the United Russia in Moscow in the head of the party's Moscow branch from March 2011 to December 2012. He is considered to be a close ally to Russian billionaire businessman Vladimir Bogdanov, Director General of Surgut Neftejaz. As the mayor of Moscow, Sobyanin has gradually relaxed the massive construction projects of his predecessor for which he has won a claim for the most sane piece of city planning in years. As mayor, Sobyanin created large mass media holding group of numbers TV and radio channels and newspapers, owned and controlled by Moscow government, and he has also won praise for his efforts in combating corruption. At the same time, Sobyanin was criticized for the banning of pride parades in the city, for which he was strongly condemned by LGBT groups. Sergei Sobyanin was born in an ethnic Mansi village of Nyaksamwal in the Khanti Mansi Autonomous Okrug. After finishing a local school in Beryazovsky district in 1975, Sobyanin matriculated to the Kostroma Technology Institute in Kostroma. On graduation he received an assignment to the large tube rolling factory in Chelyabinsk. Started working as a machinist there. From 1982 to 1984 he worked with Komsomol in Chelyabinsk. In 1984, he returned to Kogolum. There, he worked as a vice chairman of the Kogolum Selsovat, in a municipal economy department and local tax administration. In 1989, he got a second degree in jurisprudence. His PhD thesis was titled, Legal Position of the Autonomous Okregs as Federal Subjects of Russia. On 23 May 2007, at the Institute of Legislation and Comparative Jurisprudence at Government of Russia, Defense of Sobyanin's Higher Doctoral Thesis, RF Subject in Economical and Social Development of the State, were to take place on the basis of his monograph published shortly before the event. But the defense was cancelled due to an unknown reason. Examination of dissonant of Sobyanin's doctoral thesis and the monograph of 2007 exposed high level of plagiarism. In 1991, he was elected mayor of Kogolum. Since 1993, he has been the first deputy of the head of the administration of the Khanti Mansi Autonomous Okrug. In 1994, he was elected chairman of the Khanti Mansi Duma. In January 1996, he became a member of the Federation Council of Russia. Since July 1998, he has been chairman of the Constitutional Law, Judicial, and Legal Problems Committee. On 27 October 1996, he was re-elected as a delegate and a chairman of the Khanti Mansi Duma. On 12 July 2000 he was appointed the first deputy of plenipotentiary of President of Russia in the Urals Federal District. On 14 January 2001 he was elected governor of Tiumen Oblast. During the campaign, oil tycoon Vladimir Bogdanov was its confidant. He has been a member of the Supreme Council of the United Russia political party since 2004. In 2005, Sergei Sobyanin sent a request to the President of Russia about a vote of confidence. That was done in case of the change of the governor assignment procedure. Vladimir Putin nominated him for election by the Duma of the Tiumen Oblast and he was finally re-elected on 17 February 2005. In November 2005, he was appointed a head of the administration of the President of Russia. Since 21 October 2010, he has been the mayor of Moscow, awarded a Medal of Honor, Church Second Stage Order of St. Niles Daniel Moskowski, Medal of Honor in Education. French Republic Medal of Honor in Agriculture Laureate of the 2003 Russia's Man of the Year Politician Prize The preservation organization Aknadzor criticized Sobyanin for his raising of historical landmarks to make way for contemporary buildings. In March 2012, Sobyanin garnered controversy for doing little to clean up the city sidewalks. 
Moscow housing relocation program involves the demolition of dilapidated five-story blocks of flats and the relocation of their residents to modern housing. The project's aim is to prevent five-story blocks of flats from turning into hazardous housing. Unfit for living. The program stipulates providing the residents of buildings put on the demolition list with equivalent living space with amenities in new buildings in their district. The list of buildings in the program includes more than 5,000 blocks of flats with a total area of about 16 million square meters and about 1 million residents. Sobyanin has in recent years become a major target of controversy in the press. According to an independent poll, most Muscovites believe that since coming to power, Sobyanin's leadership has not differed from that of Yuri Lushkov. He was also helping to renovate the occupied city of Sevastopol. Although he w.